Israeli authorities said Tuesday one person was killed after a projectile launched from Lebanon slammed into a northern city. The Israeli military said about 50 projectiles were launched from Lebanon into Israel. It said some of the launches were intercepted by Israel's aerial defense system and others fell in the area. Israeli police said they received a number of reports of fallen projectiles which caused damage to property in the city of Malat Tarshiha. The Israeli rescue service Megan David Adam said a man was killed in the strike. The Lebanese militant group Hezbollah said it fired rockets toward the area. Hezbollah has fired thousands of rockets into Israel since October 8 last year, when it began attacking Israel in solidarity with Hamas a day after its cross-border attack. Fighting between Israel and Hezbollah has intensified in recent weeks after Israel launched a ground invasion into Lebanon. An Israeli military helicopter was seen over southern Lebanon Sunday, as smoke plumes dotted the border where Israel launched a ground invasion earlier this month after nearly a year of almost daily exchange of fire between Hezbollah and Israel. Elsewhere, two Israeli strikes killed eight people in Sidon City in southern Lebanon, with 25 wounded, according to Lebanon's health ministry. One strike hit a residential building, according to footage taken by an Associated Press reporter. The Israeli military said four soldiers, including one from the military rabbinate, were killed in fighting in southern Lebanon, without providing details. It said five other personnel were severely wounded. An explosive drone and a projectile fired from Lebanon wounded five people in Israel, authorities said. What well, is the six? Yeah, this is the, so this is a different sensor, right? It's a, it's a basically the same, really. Yeah. What's the difference? Successive Israeli airstrikes have pummeled the southern port city of Tyre in Lebanon following an evacuation warning from the Israeli military for parts of the city, Lebanon's state-run national news agency reported. Associated press footage showed thick plumes of smoke rising against the Mediterranean skyline. Local media also showed images of fires and widespread destruction to residential buildings. No casualties have been reported immediately. Following an Israeli evacuation warning, Lebanese civil defense teams patrolled the city with loudspeakers, urging residents to leave the area immediately. 